still having those kind of experiences. That, so, I get so, excited about that. Um, yeah, that, that yeah. whole concept <laughs> of, of unity. So, you know, I mean, you and I have just created this incredible <laughs> soup that right. we just keep pouring into. Right. And and who knows what's going to come of that kind of <laughs> funny chakra uh, exercise. I'll tell you because it's really helpful. So, you know, I just visualize my first chakra is just like earth, moving down my thighs to my knees to my uh, to my calves and my ankles and my feet, and then just feeling the roots into the earth and just grabbing the earth and holding on for stability and for for nourishment and drawing the earth energy up into my feet and my ankles my calves and my knees and my thighs and my first chakra just full of blood and earth and the seeds of my desires and then i move up into my second chakra and it's orange light and it rains on my first chakra and germinates the seeds of my desires and it blesses my intestines and it blesses my kidneys and it blesses my bladder and it blesses all the fluid in my body and all the lymph nodes in my body. It helps me go with the flow. It helps me to adapt. It helps me to receive and to create and to receive and I move up into my third chakra and here's this beautiful yellow sun and in the middle of the sun is my belly button and there's a vortex into my belly button that collects the solar flare energy specifically and it moves into my belly button and it stokes my ka body my spiritual body which 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 feeds all of the organs of my body and helps them to work perfectly. And this beautiful yellow sun blesses my stomach and my spleen and my pancreas and my liver and my and my, my small intestines and it shines down onto my first chakra and up grows the seeds of my desire and they they're in my fourth chakra and they're green and verdant and they explode out of my heart chakra and they're flowers and they're trees and they're fruit trees and 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 my shoulders and arms and hands and fingers glow green and all of the cancer in my body is glowing green and moves up into my throat chakra and my throat chakra is blue and it is healed in the blue light and i speak three ohms and in the ohms are the manifestations of my desires for healing and plenty and peace. Oh. Oh. to my head and I bless my eyes and I see a violet flame burning in my third eye and it expands and fills my brain blesses my pituitary gland and my pineal gland moves down my all of my spine and down into my tailbone this 
this violet flame. The violet flame fills my eyes. It fills my ears. It fills my nose and my sinuses, my mouth and my teeth and my jaw. It fills my head. And my crown chakra holds the thousand petal lotus that opens to the universe and all of the possibility there and has its unique scent that drives only those things that will forward me in the fruition of my desires and with the fruition of that which I'm here to do. My teachers, my guides, my lovers, my friends, intergalactic beings, angels, ancestors, and I have a crown of stars around my crown chakra that reaches out into the universe. And here I sit. And there's so much light around me. It's infinite light. We call it the light of the great Christos above. I hope it has other names. But I funnel this light, which is immense, through my crown chakra and into my head. And now my head, my brain, my pituitary gland, my pineal gland, my brain stem, and all the way down my spine to my tailbone. My eyes are filled with the light of the great crystals. My ears are filled with the light of the great crystal. My mouth and jaw and teeth, nose and sinuses, my entire head, filled with the light of the great crystal. My throat, my neck, filled with the light. My fourth chakra now has the still, the plentiful growth, but now it is all light. Now it is all light and it and it reaches out into infinity. You can't even see the end. And my heart is full of light. And all of the lymph nodes in my body are being fed with this beautiful light, this liquid light. They're being fed, they're being nourished. They're attaining that which they've been reaching for. I'm giving it to them willingly to my heart. And there's a beautiful white sun in my belly now where the vortex reaching out and, and drinking in the solar flare energy to stoke my claw body. And this beautiful white energy is still smell my stomach and my spleen and my pancreas and my liver and moves into my second chakra and fills all of my intestines, my kidneys, my bladder, all of the water that's within my body, all of the lymph nodes within my body filled with this white light. My first chakra is filled with this light and it moves down my thighs to my knees, to my calves, to my ankles, to my feet, to my toes, and through the earth, the roots, it buries deep into the earth 
This white light of the great crystals is deep within the earth. It's a blessing to the earth. We are a blessing to the earth. Thank you for allowing me to take that. That's something that I do. <laughs> Stand up and hug that one. Yeah. Yeah, I love you fully. Oh, thank you for allowing me to record that because we just did what I've been trying to describe you want to do is I want to facilitate ease so that people like yourself can just drop in and do your magic yeah. rather than feel drained by any anything else right that's it that's what i want to do but i need, we need to just do it yeah <laughs> i know that's right that's yeah. right thank you so much mm -hmm. it, I, it's one it's it's wonderful to do it as a solitary practice yeah. but just like the unity <laughs> practice the more it gets out there the more people use it the better off everybody's going to be. Because this is the truth. Unity is the truth. The problems that we have in the world are just because we're trying to be separate. And fighting for that separateness. Right. And so, but we know, yeah, we know that unity is where it's at. <laughs> what do you think about going putting your bare feet in the rainy grass? Okay, yeah. yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, I realize I haven't actually done that yet today, and I generally do. It's been at least a few minutes. I told you I fell. Yeah, right. And that's why I want to be extra, so extra I, careful. Like, it'd be groovy. Yeah, good.